Well, hello everyone. So, I just had an interesting experience for this recording. Uh, my microphone stand just fell apart. I think what it is, is I was, I was twisting it so much. It kind of has a stand and then another piece that's long ways for the microphone to fit on. Uh, and everything, it's a, like one long stand piece and then a long, re or long piece of feel a uh, rebar up top where you can have a different adjustments and everything to make you know the pole longer or shorter or tilt just its tilt and stuff and it just de detached from the stand part here i think what it is is i just got too much um too much what you call a uh, twisty excuse me i twisted it too much and i eventually just twisted it enough where it came off and i didn't even notice so after that fun experience, I tested the microphone and it seems to be working well, so we should be good. The reason I'm making this video, as you can see, we're in a druid, Act 5 normal. Um, I just got here not long ago, went and did the first quest to, you know, kill Shank and everything. Stay a while and listen. Uh, and I've been doing some farming to get my levels up. I was like level 29 when I got here. I'm now level 33, and I'm going to continue at least until level 35. Um, but I wanted to show what I got. Because I got something really good that I didn't expect to get in this at this point. We got a Thol rune and a Soul rune dropped off of... Uh, what's his name? The, not Shank, but the other guy up there near the waypoint. Uh, they and he dropped them both at once, so I got this both at the same time off of the uh, same monster. So, um, the reason why that is important, let me bring this over here real quick. Um, it's this one, yeah, this one. Bring this over here and I'll bring it up so you can look at it too. So, this is like the rune list, and if you go down and click like Thul, it'll take you to a page where you can look at what word rune words are made with Thul. Black, not not a uh, not melee, so don't need a black. Uh, Duris, that's a nice uh, chest piece there you could get. Uh, it gives you even more crushing blows. Still not really anything we need. Uh, Heart of the Oak, really really good, but we also need a coal a vo uh, and a vex and a pool, and that's not that's not going to be until hell. So that's that's way later. Uh, King's Grace, no obedience. Could be interesting, but again, melee only. Uh, peace, no, but here's the big thing. We can make spirit. We could also make treachery if we wanted to for our mercenary, but spirit. So this is what we could make right here. Um, it would give us, let me zoom in here. Here we go. I think everybody can see that better now. Gives us plus two to all skills, 25 to 35% cast or cast rate. It varies. Hopefully we get a higher rune word, but higher number, but I don't know. Faster recovery, defense from missiles, 22 to vitality, 80, 89 to 112 to mana, and varies. 3 to 8 magic absorb, and that is in both. And then in swords, it also gives you lightning damage, cold damage, poison damage, and 7% life stolen per hit. In a shield, it would give you... Cold resist, lightning resist, poison resist, and attack and tag, attack takes attacker takes damage of fourteen. Now, and, but we still need to get an arm rune. I have everything else. I have the tall. I have the thole now. I have the ort now. I need the arm rune. I don't. I'm like I said. I'm going to farm him until thirty five. There is a chance the arm rune is in between thol and soul. So there is a chance I could get this arm rune before I get to uh, Nightmare and farm Countess for it. So if that happens, we can do that. But we also need to get a four socket, either shield or sword. Um, shield is not until later, actually. I don't think you can get a four socket shield until way later. But we could get a four socket sword here in, um, in normal, actually. Uh, before we hit the nightmare, even. So the way to do that is to go and do. You can get a crystal sword. It has to be above eye level twenty six 
to 40 if I remember correctly. And what happens is, is it, it can't have any sockets on it. It can't be like low quality. It can't be like crud crystal sword or whatever it's called. Or, or broken crystal sword or whatever. And we could take it over here to Lazaric. What do you need? And we could add sockets to it. And he will add uh, full sockets to it. So a four socket, a four, it could be a four socket sor sword. If we get, um, if we get it above eye level 26, and right now items are dropping like eye level 30 for me. And I've had a couple crystal swords drop, but they've all been, uh, they've all been, uh, already having sockets on them. I need one to drop straight up that's just white with nothing on it. Or, yeah, something like that. Um, and it has to be above eye level 26. So if I can get that, I can get that spirit going. Now for soul, let me bring that back over here. So you can look at soul. We'll, we'll bring this back up. So let's go to soul. Soul is an interesting one to do. Because, again, we could do something for our mercenary, or we could do something for us. Um, so, these are all the rune words with soul, bone, enlightenment, eternity, fortitude, uh, el, soul, dull, low. Uh, great for uh, mercenary chess pieces, but we don't have any of the other ones, and we wouldn't get those until, like, way later in hell. Um, here is Insight. Uh, Rao, Tear, Tall, and Soul. So we could get this and give it to our mercenary, and he would give us uh, the Meditation Aurora, which would be really nice. Or we can do an Orc Soul and get us a Lore, which gives us plus one to all skills, plus ten to energy, lightning resist, damage reduced, mana after each kill, and plus two to light radius. And that's that's what I'm going to do. I'm I'm I would I would love to do the Insight. If I get another soul rune, that's where it's going to go. But I, I need the lore because just the plus one to all skills is going to give us so much extra damage. Um, right now, I'm just, since I just completed Act 4, I am running just two, I'm just running a uh, socket for uh, fire resist right now. Uh, a Ral tier. Uh, I needed just the 30 fire resist to max out my fire resist with all the other gear I have with fire resist on it. Like, I got these boots in Act 4. Uh, not 20% not run walk, but it's got 29% fire res. I said, you know what, I'll, I'll pass on the 20% plus to run walk. I can get it later, and I'll just grab me some fire resist. Um, and then I got uh, these two. I just put these two Nagel rings on, actually, to start farming better. Uh, also, I did get this uh, back in Act 1, actually. I uh, got this both. I think I got this before... Uh, I, I think I got this running through Countess, if I'm not mistaken, one of my Countess runs in normal. I got this, so this has my, been my belt since then. Um, I have 10% fire res here. These are the gloves we've had before. And then, of course, we have the... Uh, leaf here that gives us cold res and i have i ha i put my like i said i put my uh magic items uh magic find stuff on um to get that going uh i also got this if i wasn't had if i didn't have these two nagel rings i would d definitely be running this ring here but since I got two Nagel Rings, uh, I don't really need anything else right now. I am also waiting until I get um, more Topazes. I have one perfect Topaz. As soon as I get the other, I'll probably go get a two socket chest piece and put off in there. Put it off, put them both off in there and get a maximum uh, socket armor that I can for right now. Um, and stuff like that. Let's see. A couple of other notes is I when I faced Misfisto at the end of Act 3, I accidentally forgot I had it on uh, Players 5 at the time. So I, uh, yeah, I died really quickly. <laughs> I, died, I died like three or four times 
before I remembered, but I went ahead and killed him on Players 5 just to, you know, screw around to make sure I could say I did it. It took me about three or four deaths to get it, uh, to get into the rhythm before I got it, got the kill on him. Um, Axe Wars Diablo, he only killed me twice. Um, let's see. I upgraded his gear right when I got to Act 4. I gave him this chest piece instead to give him some life and then the fire res so he didn't take as much damage in there. He still got this cap on that he had before and he still got this uh, uh, Wrath Scourge. Um, he does really well against like the mobs and the bosses, the regular bosses and everything, but the end of Act bosses like Mephisto and Diablo and them, he just dies. Uh, to everything so I just when he dies there I just leave him dead until I get to the next act basically um, so let's see let's go do a run real quick I am actually on players 8 Oops. right now should have been already set but we'll make sure and then we go no pickup also, so we don't accidentally pick anything up. Let's go do a run. This guy up here is the one I was talking about who dropped the thole in the soul for us. Uh, Eldritch. Uh, a jawbone visor. Yeah, I still got that. I got that open spot to pick those up. Uh, let's see... Did I use a... No, I didn't use any. Uh, also, I'm picking up rancid gas potions to make sure I get those for later if I need them. There's I a... Carry I don't need that because I'm not running that far. Um... I always just take time to make sure I get everything that I wanted. The most dangerous one actually is Shink compared to him. He's that guy's a piece of cake compared to Shink. I after I kill him, I usually run down here and kill Shink. Shink. Hey, there's that Amrune I needed. Uh, yeah, I'm not even gonna worry about that. I also have to be kind of careful with my uh, mercenary here. He does take a pretty good bit of damage from it. So. Like I said, it takes a while on him to die. Those are super healing, super mana. Don't worry about these because these things do not get you at all. They are just for show. Uh, let's see. Just keeping an eye on his health while he's fighting whoever it is down there. Uh, it looks like there's no. Yep, no thing here. The glaive I could give him, but I would have to use my socket quest on it, and then I just reset. And as you can see, I'm almost level 34, so not Great much longer. Angles. And I got that Amarun. I wasn't ex I wasn't expecting it. I was expecting have good to wait, afternoon. but I have it now, um, so that's good. A, cold, a lot of cold resist on that. Okay. Do I have anything in my cube? Nope. I could have picked up that thing and put it in my cube to sell, but that's fine. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I've ad I've added a bunch of tabs to uh, to the deal. Like I've got now an extra gem tab. This I made into just chipped only stuff. I got a merc tab now. I separated out. Uh, runes because I was getting really full of these ith and eth runes so I separated those out so I could have room for everything uh, 
And then I'm almost full. Just got one spot left and I'd be full of rejuves there. Uh, put this jewel in here. I actually put this over here because that is kind of nice. I may want to keep that one. And let's see. That one's a full stack. That one's only got four in it. Um, we deposit the gold and we'll go do the run again. And I don't have to buy potions if I do it carefully enough. I don't have to worry about getting hurt or anything, really. I can usually always find enough potions to restock what I already use. Grab that rancid gas potion. Oop, there's a topaz. Grab that. I have used a healing potion, so pick up a super healing. Money. Money. Whoops, that's not what I wanted to pick up at all. These things are annoying, these little teleportation guys. Don't worry about them. And then I've uh, I've maxed out the uh, fissure. I'm now working on maxing out the uh, other thing. Also have uh, the since I had put these boots on, I needed 70 strength, so I reduced my vitality by a lot. It was kind of telling just a little bit or, or in the early part, but I'm getting back up to where I was. About another few more levels and I'll be back up to where I was. Yeah, it doesn't look like... There's an amethyst down there. I'll go grab it. Uh, it doesn't look like I'm getting a crystal sword here. Just got... Uh... Oh yeah, I have picked up like a couple of uh, other pieces and everything for other characters if I want to play with them, you know? I'll show those off. Like, I got a spear for the Javazon that we can use later. Oh, yes. You identify the items, not me. 18 mana. 10 energy. That's actually huge. I'm going to keep that. That's actually pretty damn huge. Um, to M section. As here, one more of these, and I'll get the flawed. Um, get back to here, put these off in here with that. Nine now. So, I was going to show like, I got this spear, it's actually pretty decent. Um, it'd be great for a, a spear is on. And then I found this that's uh, that's got nothing on it but has d two sockets, so we can make a a spear out of it if we wanted to. Um, I think I already showed off the shield I got. Yeah, the three socketed shield there that I picked up. Uh, nothing else really. Um, I did pick up a nice uh, a nice s s uh, smoked spear I think it was, but I had to get rid of it because I needed money to uh, to revive my mercenary. I was at one point really, really low on money for some reason. Um, like really low. So uh, I had to go and sell that to get my mercenary back at one point. 
So I'm back up to 244,000. I was down to like, um, uh, like 30,000 at one point. Scepter. Pick that up to see if we can sell that for anything. I think I need a key because I just used one, so that should fill me back up on keys. Uh, don't need any potions. I don't know if I need this mask or not. It'd be interesting to look at. Let's see. I was hoping they both fit so I could pick that up. We'll get stuff identified here. Greetings. All right, that wouldn't really anything. Faster hit recovery in a large charm is good. As you can see, I had to put up my other grand uh, because I got I needed more room for potions. Actually, uh, let's see. Nothing, anything good, and that is Breed of Vengeance. Interesting. Only one socket, though, which is unfortunate. And then every now and then I have to do that to get my inventory, get some inventory space. So what I can do now, I can actually run around with some free jeeps on me if I wanted to. I feel comfortable doing that now. I think I'm just gonna have to that there. Try again and see what happens. We'll do a little bit of farming before we go. Not much. And 
see, this is what I'm talking about. I keep getting... Oh, there's another soul room. That's nice. And a crown. Might not do that. No, it's a good side. Okay. I need, uh, no, I don't need scroll to identify. Each motion. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. I, I get crystal swords, but they're magic or something like that. I need one that's, uh, just, uh, what you call it? White. Or has four sockets already on it. But I don't think they can drop with four sockets until uh, later in, in uh, Nightmare. I don't think they can drop four sockets. gloves. Interesting. Impossible. I didn't think so. That's okay. I don't really need them at this point. And that's like been my farming experience here. Stay a while and Pretty listen. decent. Thanks for getting the runes. Poison link reduced. That's no good. Okay. So I don't need to pick up any more rejuves unless I need one. Now, uh, let's see. Go back. Soul rune. So I got another soul rune, which is good. That can go towards uh, insight later for my mercenary. Uh, and yeah, see, this is unfortunate part of that. That's not gonna, you know, work for me. I'm also gonna oh, sell that mana help. potion here. It's just in my way of things like that. Doing stuff like that. We're, we're making money. I will say we are making money. More than we're uh, spending it. Because now we've got 50000 more. I'm almost 300000 there. I don't think I can get a... Uh, crystal Sword. Yeah, Crystal Sword is blue. Crystal sword blue. I just don't think I can grab one. Um, Also, our mercenary's leveling up really nicely, too. He's, like, level 34, so he's, like, right on par with me, almost. Uh, um, don't need any of these things. Uh, 
Come on with me, mercenary. You don't need to be fighting them guys up there. You need to be down here with me in the trenches. Trenches. Okay. Didn't need the healing potion. Just wanted the ranch gas potion. Flutie guys, watch out for those. I didn't mean to use that review. Take a look up there for that Reju potion because I'm gonna need it now. Um, yeah, I'll take these to take a peek at them. See if they're any better than the ones I'm wearing. They might be. Uh, burnt wand could be worth some money. Now I can use, you know, a long sword. But I would rather have the crystal sword. It's better to use. Uh, but you can use the long sword for this. So I'm going to keep on going. Uh, can I? I think I could fit that long sword in there. I'm going to just hold on to it. Let's see. I'll go up here, back up here and grab that rejuve so I can get my rejuve back that I accidentally used. Yes. So we're actually, you know, doing really well. Uh, I also, I guess I didn't show this, I also got the Telly Staff. Uh, cost me a little bit more than normal. Uh, the normal price for it with just a teleport on it cost. Uh, 40 uh cost 17k i paid yes. 40 something k for mine what do we got okay uh, yeah i'll do i'll lose the fire res to get more cold and poison res because i'm kind of low on all those so yeah i'll give that a shot it only takes me down to like 58 fire res and brings my cold resistance up to 61 from 33 and my poison res is going up to 30 to 54. So I say it's worth it. I'm going to definitely keep those though for other times if I need them. See, this is only like fast. So it, it can work, like I said, but I would need to put some decks in. Plus one to bone spear. Okay. Oh, I filled that up. Did I? Okay. Yeah, sure. Um, I don't need more than two, so I'm just going to drop that. It'll be worth a little bit of money. He says as he gets 9k back. <laughs> yeah, it's worth a little bit of money, he says as he gets 9k back. Well, before I continue on, because this could go forever, this farming right here, I'm going to just call it here i'll be back once i get to nightmare and dariel and because that's where we're going to farm uh by then i will probably have a spirit i may or may not have an insight for my mercenary and i may or may not and i will have a lore for myself so i will be back probably actually before i go let's go ahead and just do the lore right now we can do it in this encampment here Good day. I have to may have to reset her a couple of times to get a two socket open socket helmet. But I have a really nice deal. I could also use the waypoint too since it's right next to her. Greetings. So let's see. Two sockets. Looking for two sockets, dear. Good 
good day. You just don't want to give it to me. I've had this problem when I went and go tried to get my Ral 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 my Ral helmet. Is good I just could see. not get them to give me a two socket open helmet. Let me go check let me go check the other axe to see if they got anything here. Greetings. Okay. Well I have the strength for it, so I guess I'll just go ahead and use this. Two sockets, so ort and soul. Are you at? Ort. Wait, before I do that, let me make sure. Ort, soul. Yeah, it's over there to right to the left of me. Ort and soul. And there we go, a lore. Uh, plus one all skills, plus 10 energy, lightning resistance plus 30, damage reduced, man after each kill, and two to light radius. Yes. An upgrade. All right, let me put this back off into um, uh, here, because that's just a gemmed deal. It's not got anything special in it. Okay. So let's see. What does my resistances look like now? So I'm back. I'm up to sixty-one. Hold res. Uh. Low, my fire res dropped a ton, and my lightning resistance is 36. Um, if I take these off and put these other boots back on, what's everything going to be at? 50s, 30s, 30s, 30s. So I'm in the 30s minimum on everything, and if I switch to this one, I will be what? I'm not on 30 on everything, but I am higher in other things. So I could get some fire res, more fire res on gloves if I'm lucky. Um, yeah. Um, definitely could get more fire res and other pieces of gear. Let's see, we have a 10 faster cast rate amulet that I'd use. This gives me some lightning res. Okay, and here is another deal of faster casting. Oh, I did find this big old life amulet too that I could use. Um, yeah, I wasn't using this uh, ring up here. I was just using these two here for my faster cast rate because I had a nagel ring. I like having at least one of them on me. I could get some magic fine. Here's a faster cast rate plus light radius ring too. And here is a big old lightning resist amulet that I found. If I wanted to go max out my lightning resist, I could do that with that. Um yeah, I just need res in other places. I need fire res and I need uh, some more lightning res. But the lightning res will pretty you much have. almost get taken... Pretty much be taken care of if I get... Uh, what you call it? Uh, an amulet on. That will give me a ton of lightning res. Uh, let's see. So, yeah. Um, I'm just going to run with these boots instead. I like them. Uh, let's see. So, we're doing pretty good now. we got 24 in Fissure. Uh, almost 20 with points. Kind of. Uh, on... Uh, what do you call it? The Wave Firestorm. Um, so, yeah. Uh... Like I said, uh, I'm about to do my run through of Act 5, so, and then get to Nightmare and I'll start farming that, especially Countess. Uh, I'll probably also do Normal Cows, because that's another place that can drop the uh, Crystal Sword. So I'll probably go do Normal Cows trying to get a Crystal Sword, unless I can find it somewhere here. At your service. Uh doesn't look like nope he's only got the that one the rest of it's not there all right 
Well, thanks everybody for watching. I'll come back next time with Nightmare and Dario Runs, and I'll see you then. Bye.